Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and somebody's trying to use the transformation or the uh, perspective tool to kind of make this look like it, and that's just not going to work. Uh, they might, they want it like a ring going around the Earth, like the middle of the equator. So if we're going to go to edit, step and repeat, and we're going to have 25 of them, whoop, I need to go space between centers, and on the top, vertical, I have no offset. So that made me 25 of these blocks. I'm actually going to make them a little bit smaller and zoom in. Now, you can either group or not group, but I would suggest going to Control-G to group this together and put it in the center of the page. Take an ellipse and hit P, put it in the center of the page. You really want the lips bigger than the circle, bigger than the object. So we're gonna, I'm holding down the shift key so it grows from the center. So now everything's in the center. And we're gonna select just the just the ring, not the blocks. Go up to effects and lens and pick fish eye. And look what it did. It made it look like these are bigger, they're tapering off around a corner. Now, to make this work, you've got to go to Frozen and freeze it. And then you can go to Object, Group, and Ungroup, and you can get rid of your ellipse. That's a pretty cool effect. And you could do this with a, the whole, you know, the fisheye lens would let you do it with the whole thing. You know, you could have squares uh, for the whole thing. That's, that's the only reason I've ever done it before. I've never done it with just one line but it makes sense and it makes it look like it's disappearing around the corner. Hope that helped. Thank you for watching.